Hello and welcome. Let's make fish curry today. Yes, Odia style fish curry. Here I have eight medium size pieces of rohu fish, one potato which is chopped to thick slices, one tomato which is chopped, turmeric powder, chili powder, salt, ginger garlic paste, two green chilies, few cilantro, few bay leaves, one chopped onion and half cup of mutton. Next to this goes half teaspoon of turmeric powder, a little of chili powder as per your preference and salt. Give it a good mix. Coat all the pieces of fish with all these dry spices. Let it rest by the time we'll heat some oil in the pan. Here I have taken around 3 tablespoons of mustard oil. And once the oil is hot, let's fry all our fish pieces. Once one side of the fish is cooked, flip it over to the other side. And let it get fried. I have flipped all the fish pieces now and those steel sharp spatulas does a very good work something like this when you are working with fish but here I am using a non-stick and these wooden spatulas are not that great. Fish is fried from both the sides now time to take them out of this pan let's take them out. Next to the leftover oil in the pan goes our sliced potato. We are going to fry them until they are light brown in color from all the sides. Potatoes are fried now. I am going to take them out. Next to the leftover oil in the pan I have added one more tablespoon of oil. And in goes green chili, bay leaf. Give it a mix and next goes chopped onion. Just a little salt for the onions to cook faster. Once the onions are translucent, in goes the chopped tomato to it. Give it a mix and let it cook for next two minutes until the tomatoes are soft and tender. Tomatoes are done. In goes ginger garlic paste. I'm gonna take two and a half tablespoon of ginger garlic paste to this salt to taste. Turmeric powder about one teaspoon. Chili powder as per your preference. Now give it a mix. Allow it to cook until the raw flavor of ginger and garlic is gone and until the oil starts to separate from this masala. It's been 5 minutes and the masala is almost cooked now. At the time I'm gonna add these potatoes to it. And a little water around one tablespoon and give it a mix and allow it to cook for next five minutes after five minutes let's take out the lid give it a good mix next to this goes all these green peas give it a mix once again and let it cook for next one to two minutes. After two minutes I'm going to add water to it. I have added five cups of water to it. Now I'm gonna cover it once again and allow it to cook for next five minutes on high heat until it starts to boil. After five minutes let's take the lid out. It has already started boiling. Give it a good mix. And let's add our fried fish pieces to it.
Now turn down the heat to low and allow it to cook for next 20 minutes. After simmering for 20 minutes, this is how my fish curry looks like. Now is the time to turn off the heat. Throw in some cilantro on top. And our fish curry is ready to serve. Fish curry is ready. Do try it out and let me know if you like it or not. See ya. Bye.